wonderful morning, everybody. What are you smelling? There's a, a waskily, hoppily little thing over there. I said, there it is. There it is. So, I know this looks a bit of a, a mess of timbers and whatnot. And the hair are, are here. But this is the Toowoomba Stockyards. There's so much so many smells and sniffs. Now we, I don't want to go in there. The reason for it is there is a biosecurity thing in place in Toowoomba. Um, mostly to, well, it's, it's uh, only to uh, keep the cattle from getting sick. Keep them healthy. He says, I want to get to the pole, Dad. We need the pole. Poles are very important. Should know that. He didn't get a chance to pee on it. So he got dragged away. Yeah, so there's, um, obviously you got ticks coming in from uh, from further west and whatnot. There's pigeons. Then doves. And there's also a, another pest, but which I can't remember what it is. And uh, every time that you bring your beasties for sale here, um, you're supposed to have a certificate to say that they don't have this particular pest. Uh, most, uh, it's primarily just so that they, they don't want pests going from one beastie to a, to the next. So if you've got a prize bull or something like that up for sale, um, you don't want the, something in the next stall to you to uh, have a bug and get your $5,000 bull um, infected. Or, and then that, that, that bug will go right through uh, all their breeding stock. So this is quite a popular sale yard. Happens I think like uh, once or twice a month. Of course, not on a weekend. As you can see, it's very industrial down here. And we've got a uh, private school there, Concordia Lutheran College. This is all originally farmland. No, we've got beasties over there, down there. Good day. We've got beasties. having a, a feed before they go to auction. So many snares. Coming down, we uh, saw quite a few dogs going for walks. So I think St. Saviour's is that one on the left. So you've got two private schools competing with each other right here. And this is Long Street. And it's uh, quite a well, fairly major road. Same as what uh, our street is. And you've got a containers for change here. So you get 10 cents per container for your plastic containers and, well, some plastic containers and uh, glass. They only do take some glass, uh, like uh, soft drink bottles, they'll, they'll take. Um, beer bottles, they'll take. 
Um, keep going that way. No, that, that way. Oh, he's stuck around a tree and he says, what do I do, Dad? I'm stuck. Oh, I've got to get him unstuck. And as I was saying, before he got stuck and wrapped up in a tree, which he very rarely does, he usually works it out, and he did think about it, but she pulled and his lead got tight. And... Uh, but, uh, yeah, they don't take wine bottles or anything like that, which is strange. There must be uh, something in the glass of, of the wine bottles. I don't know. She's all wrapped up in her lead. So I'm going to have to fix that too. It's like they've got a, a primary school here. Or preschool, maybe. Yeah, preschool. So preschool, primary school, probably a high school. Kindergarten. There you go. That's what they call them now.